You're looking at an image from the Google I.O. conference and what exactly, you might be asking yourself, what exactly is the Google I.O. conference? The Google I.O. conference. Does that mean that somebody owes money to Google? I.O. Google, Google I.O. conference? Uh, I.O. in this instance stands for input and output. Input and output. So the four basic functions of a computer, IPOS, IPOS, input processing, output storage. And sometimes you'll hear about I.O. devices. And so Google has this conference called Google I.O. So in relation to computers, you will hear the phrase sometimes I.O., like as in I.O. devices or as in Google I.O. And what that I.O. is referring to is input and output, just so you are in the know. Now when you hear about Google I.O., you will know, <laughs> a little rhyme there, just so you're in the know. Now when you hear about Google I.O., you will know that Google I.O. is uh, about input and output and not about owing anybody any money. So these I, this I and the zero kind of look, look like ones, and this I and this O kind of look like ones and zeros, which is just sort of an interesting coincidence, I think. If you want to know more about Google I.O., you can search Google I.O. and you'll read about the developers conference they have every year up in San Francisco. And you can even ask for a ticket to attend if you're interested, though they give the tickets out by lottery. And the main thing you're learning in this video right here, however, is this phrase I.O., which looks very similar to one and zero. One and zero I.O. look pretty similar just by coincidence. What I.O. stands for is input and output and often will refer to I.O. devices being, you know, like input or output devices. Like how is somebody interacting with the computer? What kind of I.O. devices are they using? So that's where you'll hear I.O. devices being referred to. And you need to remember that the four basic functions of a computer are input, processing, output, storage. And what we're talking about when you hear I.O is uh, the I.O. part of IPOS, input and output. So just a little terminology for you here and uh, another phrase to know about when studying computers.